some boring stuff before I start. Make sure the audio mixing is okay and everything. I know in the last couple of streams it was an issue, so that's why I'm being extra careful with it now. I was way too quiet. Here's something I calculated. I said, "Wow, you're too quiet." Oh, are we stuck in the loading screen now? Mayhaps. Nope. Okay. We'll win. Okay. The game is way too hard. But... <clears throat> it might also help that I don't have a great place to put my microphone right now. But I also don't want to use the uh, the headset mic, which it actually might be defaulting to right now. Let me check. Aha, uh -huh, yeah, it is defaulting to my headset. Okay. So that is better, but I still think I should turn the game down. This game, Fallout 4, is probably one of my favorite games of all time, probably in the top 10 to be honest. Um, <clears throat> probably in the top 3 in terms of just how many hours I've sunk into this game, man. I love this game so much. Um, I will be running it with mods, although I want to keep the gameplay experience as faithful as possible, just because it's been a while since I've had a faithful playthrough, and this is the first time I'm playing through the game on my channel. So I feel like that's kind of expected. So in terms of what I have going, um, I do have like cheat mods installed just for like casual playthroughs. Um, but I will let you guys know that if it doesn't have a check mark next to it on the uh, the load order screen, it's not. Uh, it's because it's not activated. So, Clean and Simple Sanctuary, basically it just makes it so that I don't have to run around Sanctuary and scrap everything. Everything's all scrapped already and put into like a box, and I can use those items. It's it's just really convenient for saving time. I do want to keep it as faithful as possible, when it, but when it comes to like settlement management, I want to uh, try and reduce that. I, I want to turn this into like an exploring and story exploring playthrough, and I feel like you guys just sitting around and watching me do chores the whole time will kind of just be a bummer. Um, this is basically just like, it, you can you can adjust different, more specific audio stuff. You can turn turrets down and stuff. It's just to make the game less annoying in those aspects. Um, things like no more twigs are just for performance issues. Um, companion infinite ammo I actually want to disable. Sorry about that. Um, first person animation tweaks, it just basically makes it so that, like, when you move your guns down and everything, um, it's just aesthetic changes. This one's just funny, um, it changes the loading screens to, uh, hee hee ha ha's, so if you guys want to enjoy those, there you go. No settlement attacks is the same thing that I talked about with me doing chores, I just really don't want to have to worry about settlements too much, I feel like that's just kind of annoying, so, um, yeah. No build limit. If I do end up building something, I'll probably do it off stream, to be honest. Um, but this is just if I feel like getting creative with it. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me, I don't know why my voice is cracking so much today. 
this basically mean this this mod uh, shot your face is basically just people won't talk to you if you're not within a certain distance because you will get like multiple NPCs talking to you at a time and it's really annoying um, performance performance sanctuary bridge fix I might turn that off just so you guys can see what the bridge looks like I don't need that um, performance performance scrap that element it allows you to scrap more stuff but this can actually break the game sometimes so I will get rid of that one <clears throat> Uh, non-faithful. This is basically just, like, fixing bugs and stuff. Um. Yeah, I don't, I think I only recently installed that one, so I can't fully tell you, but I promise you it is faithful to the game. And that's everything. I'm going to reorder stuff so that the, uh, the installed mods are prioritized here. And it's, it's been a while since I've installed some of these, so if they're not up on the store anymore, I apologize. Like, I know one of the things I, uh, one of the things that I accidentally uninstalled isn't up anymore, which is the, uh, it's the spring mod that makes everything more green, but I wasn't thinking of playing with that anyways. I actually have to update some of these sometimes. If I update it, it's because I have the DLC now. Hopefully they should still be functional, but... Yeah, so that's what we got going. I'm just going to want to reload now. Again, just checking the stream to make sure audio is okay. If it would finish loading. I have played this game enough to know what's optimal. Um, I'm going to try and avoid fully optimizing and all that. Okay. I think my audio is fine. But I'm going to try and avoid optimizing. If there's cool, if there's like cool secret stuff then cool I'll go with it like early game I can definitely optimize easily but um <clears throat> I'm just gonna try and reduce that with this I'll make a new save um I did have a skip intros mod on I'm turning that off in case people are watching that haven't seen the intro before. If you're watching, you probably have seen the intro before. This game, jeez, I think it came out in like 2014, right? Twenty fifteen was the initial release date. Still crazy to think about. That's eight years ago. All right, I'm gonna shut up for the intro.
war. War never changes. In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid for myself, for my wife, for my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, it's that war, war never changes. Easily one of the best video game intros ever. I don't know how fitting it is to this. It's a good prelude to what happened for people that played the other Fallout games, but this game doesn't really War never changes. care that much. You're going to knock know. him dead at the Veterans Hall tonight, hon. You think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. So just because I seldom, if ever, play as the female, and I've heard that her voice acting is really good in this game. <laughs> I'm going to be an old man, that's how it works. Uh, no, triangle, I'm stupid. Hey, my turn, big guy. Let's see if I can find one of the default phases here. That's interesting. I'm kind of digging uh, phase seven here. Just kind of with the, it's giving me action movie vibes. See if I can't uh, fiddle with some of the makeup. I don't know. I kind of like it as is. I change the color up a bit. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm just going to go with the default here, to be honest. Nah, I'll just go default. <laughs> Let's see if there's anything interesting I can put on here. Having a scar might be cool.
Nah, I keep on I keep on making it worse. I feel like this is perfect. It's moving. Hey, hun. Just getting ready. I can't punch anybody yet. That's depressing. We got ugly baby. God, it has been so long since I booted this game up. I just, I love this game so much. We really need to get those vacation photos developed. I'm so proud of him. There's just so much crazy stuff. Every single time I do a playthrough of this game, even if the beginning is kind of the same... Thanks, Codsworth. Of course, Mom. Um. What was I saying, even? I'm gonna try not to interrupt dialogue, but there's a lot of dialogue in this part, so if I end up interrupting something, I apologize. Um, even if the beginning is the same, every single time I play this game, there's just something new that I haven't found yet, you know? Sound like someone made a stinky. <laughs> I, you, young Sean. I want to see the I stinky, we bro. I'm glad we got I'm not talking to you. Poopy baby. Poop. I thought you said you were going to change him, bro. Did you just say that so that I wouldn't change him? You think I'm a horrible mother? I can't believe you. I gotta look something up real quick for reasons that if you've played this game before, you'll probably know. Uh, it's that salesman again. I don't know why he keeps bothering you. I'll take care of that in a sec. Okay, I got a good one. <clears throat> Let me adjust the audio real quick, see if I can't turn it back up and keep it balanced. Okay. Good morning! vault -Tec calling. vault -Tec is calling. No offense, but no soliciting. Oh, no worries, ma'am. No worries at all. I'm not selling anything. Not today. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. Maybe I don't want to talk to you. No. <clears throat> you do. Now I know you're a busy woman, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being um, <laughs> a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. <clears throat> One of the best voice options in the game. Uh, just go away. Ah, dude. Won't take but a moment. We do need to verify some information to make sure you're cleared for entrance in the unforeseen event of <clears throat> total atomic annihilation. The apocalypse? Well, hell, sign me up. <laughs> <laughs> That's the spirit. Now, let's see. I'm so upset at that. The, the go away option is different for the female, apparently. 
Because I'm, I'm pretty sure if you're the male and you say go away, it's just literally like go away. Um, I just like messing with that guy though. Perfectly kid friendly name. I think we're going a bit into charisma. I might. I don't know if I want intelligence. I might go with idiot savant this time. Literally, there's a poster in my room with all the perks for this game and all the levels on it, so I think Idiot Savant is level 5 luck, and that would want me to insert, that would want me to put nothing into intelligence. But then again, there's so much fun stuff that you can do with intelligence, I might as well just put it into intelligence, at least for this playthrough. I like having high charisma, because a lot of the interesting voice options come from that in this game. Strength is gonna... I don't, I don't really know if I care that much about strength, to be honest. I might go 2 on that. Nah, 3. Three, I feel like is fair. I don't plan on using vats much unless like there's an enemy left over from an encounter and I have no idea where the hell they are. Um, I don't know if there are any good perks. Yeah, there are. There's lock picking. I'm stupid. Endurance. Endurance is going to be annoying in the early game. Agility and luck. I could take some of intelligence and put it into agility, but... Honestly... I really don't care about strength. I think I'm content with this. Yeah, I'm content. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? No. For you and Sean, no price is too high. Except paperwork. <laughs> Good answer. I have no. my moments. Horrible. You're a terrible husband. Sean has I hope you die. But he absolutely refuses to calm down. Oh, because I you did it. Some of that maternal affection you seem to be so good at. <laughs> if by <laughs> maternal affection you mean Maybe feeding my child crack rocks, then yes, I'll get on it. My boy isn't giving his mother any trouble, is he? Hey, I fixed that mobile on his crib the other day. Why don't you give it a spin? <laughs> he was not there literally a second ago. He was not there. That's my boy, on his best behavior, just like his dad. Well, most of the time, anyway. Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Yeah, sounds like fun. Sir? Mom? You should come and see this! Codsworth? What's wrong? Codsworth, shut the fuck up. Can I, can I not spin the mobile? Did they Eric proof this game? I'm so offended right now. Followed by Yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes. Codsworth? Sounds of explosions. Oh, this... We're uh, trying to get confirmation. We seem to have what? lost contact with what our affiliate stations. Bruh. Oh no. We do we do have we do have coming in. That's um Confirmed reports, I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. Oh my God. We need to get to the vault. Now! I've got Sean. Let's go. Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered, evacuate Bruh. to Vault 111 immediately. If I die because of Nate... He's been glitching out with the audio and all that. Hold on, little guy. Hold on. All registered vault participants, this way. Just help me pack it up. If you are registered, evacuate vault 111 immediately. 
Hey. Oh my god, oh my god! Participants, check in at the goal this way! I am not on the list. You don't get in. I'm going in. You can't stop me! Oh, 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 okay, okay. I'm reporting this! If you're in the program, step forward. Otherwise, return home! We need to get in. We're on the list. Infant, adult male, adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. Good luck, you sir. You two, follow me. And Come God on. What's going to well, happen to all go. those people it's outside the gate? Path. Everything we can. Now it's a keep straight line. Step on the platform in the center. Okay, I just want to say something. Canonically speaking, this bomb is about to go off. It goes off several cities away on the other side of the state. We're in Massachusetts right now, I think. Almost there. Is Sean okay? He's fine. We're gonna be okay. I love you. Oh my god! And... I don't know if it's just that big, or if we're just way too Hold close on! to this. That did not look like the other side of the map of this game. The map of this game is enormous. We did it. We made it. We're okay. Everyone, please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home. Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just. Yes, up the stairs. I can't believe it. I think I made it. I'm seeing this game already. Later. Uh, no, no. All be. don't get caught up thinking about that. If you know what I'm talking You're about, safe now. you know what I'm talking Everyone, about. Just head up these stairs but uh, I, I input there. a wrong word somewhere. Just this way, please. Hey there. Up the stairs. Now. Hopefully I'll be able to uh, remedy that is in just a moment. This way, now. Step over to the table. Take a seat. Just this way. Welcome. Okay, welcome. Pick up a suit right here. Here you are. Head down. Right over there. Thanks. Good. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you. Where's my husband and my baby? See? How this did you get here? Home. Oh, you're gonna love it here. This is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that the others aren't great, mind it's you. It's gone. Our home. Everything we had. My mother and father down in DC. How long do you think we'll be down here? Oh, oh we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical items we have to get through first. Good fit, don't you think? Trying to go around me? Don't you dare. Hey! This way, please. Just this way. Follow me. This way, please. Gonna be pretty hard to follow you when I... Just this way. Can't move. Just this way. This way, please. Hey. Follow me. Just this way. This way, please. Follow me. Follow me. This way, please. Hey. Vault Tech is Just here. Step for you. in here. Just and follow put your, your vault suit on. It'll be Excuse okay. me. Step Mommy's into ready. the chamber See? whenever you're ready. Honey, could you help me? Who is my little guy, huh? I'm not going far. I'll just be over there. Bro, even the baby fucking hates you, man. There she is, see? Mommy's not going far. All set? Just step inside and put on your vault suit. I'm so mad that I can't punch the baby. It's cool though, we won. The pod will decontaminate and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. Occupant vitals normal. Procedure complete. In five, four, three.
so I was gonna say something, but I'm too stupid to remember. What the hell was I gonna say? God, red ants. At least we still have the backup. Cryogenic sequence. Now, fuck the baby, take me. Yeah, completely lost what I was gonna say. I think there will be an opportunity to remedy the uh, the issue that I've unintentionally uh. created. <laughs> <laughs> also, sorry about all the, uh, the knocking on the door earlier. I didn't realize it would interrupt the, uh, the subtitles like that. Also, I remember it now. The the issue where if I turn away from somebody, I can't hear them. That might be the uh, don't talk to me mod. So, I gotta make sure to face people when they're talking now. Come on, come on, come on. Oh god. I'll find who did this. And I'll get Sean back. I promise. I, for one, intend on doing neither of those things. I'm literally just taking your wedding ring so I can sell it for money. I'm immediately going to marry somebody else. <coughs> Ball peen hammer. My peen has balls. Nothing in that toolbox. Oh wait, I think it wants me to try this. <laughs> Inaccessible. So we zoom in now. Bruh. I'm not gonna go through all the... The, um... Getting some pretty decent random loot drops here. I'm sorry for interrupting my own train of thought. But that Wonder Blue is stellar. I don't know if it's guaranteed to spawn there. Um, I'm not going through all of the uh, the terminal dialogue. I'm not. I'm not even going to do anything. I am not doing that. But there is. If you see me messing with terminals, it's because I know something. And I want to uh, collect it. I'm gonna yoink the baton. Uh. Giant roaches. What the hell? Yeah, this is happening. I went to sleep in a cryo chamber and I woke up. Yeah. This is happening. What a wacky predicament we're in, guys. Make sure to smash that like button if you like wacky predicaments in your video games. I don't remember if there's anything I even care about in here. Because I think everything's already looted. Yeah. Waste of time! Here's what I was talking about. Uh -huh. I've unlocked video games inside of video games. I'm winning. Hang on.
That's so rude. I'm supposed to kill the bug, man. I don't want to have to deal with him. Oh. Wrong thing. I meant to, uh... I meant to crouch. If this is any indication of how the game is gonna go, then... I think we're in good standings. What happened here? Bro, I gotta activate this skeleton. Where is then. everyone? Tee -tee -tee. <laughs> drugs. Drugs are great, kids. Always do drugs. I'm sticking with the baton for now. I don't want to waste. I need my bullets. Guys, if you like funny memes, make sure to smash that like button. I got two 10 millimeter pistols, bro. Nice. And then there's this. Coming back later for you. Fun fact, we can just glitch this out now and not have to worry about the lock picking. I honestly do not care about that weapon at all. I'm I'm cool without it, but I might come back and get it for the memes. I'm just going to take a nap. Got to keep moving. Don't need sleep. Yep. She's trying to sass me. How much ammo do I have now? 118. What is these? Uh, sorry, it wants me to try to open the door manually and then terminal it's not gonna work and I have to go to the terminal. And now I gotta move. Autobots, move out. I'm not sure. I'm not sure the bugs. I'm missing bugs though. But I would have done that on the game anyways. It's been too long since I played this game. Bro, I have so many meats. You wouldn't even believe it. Are we in the fun, fun, happy room now? Oh, oh yeah, we're in the fun, fun, happy room. There's a dude that's gonna come out of here, watch. Oh, uh, there are storage containers here that I honestly didn't know about for the first few playthroughs of this game. I have some extra ammo in them. Barely also a roach. Well, some death. I'm stupid. I can be both. I'm content with both. Two and one. Let's go. Put my arm back on here, man! That was in poor taste. I'm sorry to all you Skeletor fans out there. We've unlocked the menu. Huzzah. So, hang on. This is what I mean. This is like our entire town. This area is our entire town, right? The bomb went off here. This is like a major city. I don't know. I mean, definitely like... A real bomb would be that big, I guess. Like, if you go on to the, uh, there's, like, nuke simulators that you can go on and drop Sar Bomba in your hometown. Like a gentleman. And it, it is about that big, to be honest. Bro, watch this. I'm gonna speedrun this shit. You zoom in.
God, it's taking forever. I forgot how long it takes for that thing to get, get uh, yoinked out. Before I say anything about the, uh, the issue that I have, I want to see if it'll let me resolve it. Yes! Okay. So. There we go. And now we can actually begin the game. Enjoy again. your return to the surface. And From here... I'm pretty sure it's completely open world. Like you can literally just go to the final place. You will get your you will get your shit kicked in if you go to the final place from here. But you can. So there's that. I don't know if you can complete the game from here to be honest. You did you have to do like quests and side quests, I know that, but I don't know how much of it you have to do. I'm gonna try and do a, a good amount of it. It's just interesting to think about. Right away is nice. Stim packs are nice. Do I have the stim pack? I do. Okay. It's been a while since I played this game, so I might be a bit rusty on the controls. There's another game I've been playing recently that I haven't played in forever. Uh, I got back into Among Us yesterday, and I haven't been able to put it down. I forgot how much I love that game. I think there is something up this way. If you want to go to town, you go back down that way there, drop in there and get some stuff. But, I'm going to go up this way first. There might be enemies or something up this way, if I remember correctly, so... I'm not detected yet. But there should be more loot up here that we can use. Ooh. Is that a mole or am I stupid? Yep. L mold W human. Yeah. So I think it's just that. Yeah, the gunner symbol here. I think that's a gunner symbol. It might be another symbol actually now that I think about the plot of this game. So I think the only direction that you can't go is that way. Because you will be blocked off by nature. Am I going the right way even? <laughs> I don't think I went the right way. If I only had a bobby pin. Where the hell am I? I didn't know this existed, to begin with. Uh, that's an ammo box in there, so I'm gonna mark this here. And then I'll go back to Vault 111 and collect that one spot that I missed. And I'll come back to the uh, the marked location I have there when. I get bobby pins. Am I going the wrong way again? God damn it.
Random gunfire time. Shmovenize him. You're coming with me. We all. Forget, can I make a custom like thing here? No, I can only make a pen. Okay. Sucks, but it is what it is. <sighs> the moment we've all been waiting for. Not coming back home. Y'all already knew this was gonna happen, probably, but the moment that we've all been waiting for. As I live and breathe, oh, it's it's really you. Okay, so not yet. Codsworth, what happened to the world? Besides our geranium still being the envy of Sanctuary Hills, I'm afraid things have been dreadfully dull around here. Things will be so much more exciting with you and Sir back. Where is your better half, by the by? They... They killed him. Oh, Mum, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, I... I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this, this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or, or perhaps Shiraz. Oh, Sean does so love that game. Too soon, Godsworth. Is, is the lad uh, with you? Sean's been kidnapped. And I'm going to find him. I'm gonna get my baby back. Ribs. It's worse than I thought. Mm -hmm. You're suffering from <laughs> hunger-induced paranoia. Not I'm sorry. Probably, but 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> 200 years? What? Are you sure? A bit over 210, actually, Mum. It'll take a little for the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. That means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack. You must be famished. Bro, I'm going to seduce Codsworth. Let's go. Codsworth, you're acting a little weird. What's wrong? I... I... Uh, Mom, it's been just horrible. I don't think that you two can fail that regardless. No talk to no one to serve i spent the first 10 years trying to keep the floors waxed but nothing gets our nuclear fallout from vinyl wood <laughs> nothing and don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house <laughs> and the car the car how do you polish rust Stay with me, pal. Focus. I'm afraid I don't know anything, Mum. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were, were dead. I, I did find this holotape. I believe Sir was going to present it to you as a, as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. Thank you, Codsworth. You're, you're welcome. Now, and I'm feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? Sir and young Sean may turn up yet. 
Have you seen anything dangerous? Oh, just the usual, Mum. Pesky neighborhood dogs and mosquitoes. Shall I investigate? All right. Lead the way. Proud to serve, Mum. All right. I'm going to see if I can interrupt him. Hey, Codsworth, hold up. Miss Aspects. Don't worry. My search protocols are on full alert. Howdy yes. Howdy. Did it, boys. Oh, I forgot how to bats. Oh, there we go. Don't need it anyways. That was all me. Completely me. Don't even worry about it. Hey there, Codsworth. We'll find them, Mum. You have my word. Keep an eye out for Reds, Mum. Accidentally interrupted dialogue. My bad. I need the meats. Miss Aspects, your your family isn't here either. They're, they're really gone, aren't they? Yes. Thanks for trying, Codsworth. You can't keep up, Mum. What about the city? Concord is nearby, and well, the people there have only shot at me a few times. Thanks for your help, Codsworth. Good luck, Mum. You'll find young Sean. I know you will. I shall remain here and secure the home front. All right, I'm probably gonna get off at about midnight. By the way, I know literally nobody's watching, but you know, middle. So there are a couple of uh, super secret secrets here that uh, I want to grab before we do anything. The first one is going to be behind one of these houses. I forget exactly which one. But there will be a root cellar with a ton of good stuff in it. So it's probably on the other side then. If it's not this one. Ah, here we go. Yeah, so there's going to be crazy good stuff in here. Um, other than just junk and canned food. There's all this. Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to enjoy the radio. But we have literal bars of gold. Including this one. We did get a wonder glue this one here. And I'll have to come back for that... Uh, that lock picking thing. And a Molotov too. That might help. Out of bobby pins. Can I even oh, I forgot. Do I have upgrades available? Like did I level up at all? No. Okay, I'll have to come back for that then. That in the uh the thing I pinned earlier. Once I find some bobby pins. There might literally just be some in the uh the scrap thing. There's another thing, but it's kind of out of our way. So I'll wait a bit before I go to that. There we go. This is supposed to be on the house in the house. I think in Sean's room. Um, but you get a free attribute improvement. And choose Charisma. And then Grognak the Perfect. Barbarian. You kind of just keep this with you. It doesn't weigh anything. And it gives you a cool buff. Um, so yeah. All of this stuff naturally spawns within the area. It's just, uh, now it's all consolidated in one spot. Which is really helpful, actually. Now I don't have to spend 
like actually ours. Nah, I have to spend actual hours scrapping everything and collecting everything. And... Yeah. So I'm going to transfer all my junk first off. Um, aside from... Well, I'll see what I can deposit first. I want to keep all the rounds. I want to keep all the weapons. Except... I'm going to keep the pipe pistols on me just so I can sell them. Because they're kind of trash. Um, going to get rid of most of the food. I'm going to get rid of the drugs. Um, I'll keep the Nuka Colos just for the memes. The purified water, while well, I don't have the last impacts. Cool. Um, I got some bobby pins, so I'll have to go back to that pin spot. Then I'll see if I can equip some stuff. Although the, uh, the Vault 11 suit is pretty neat. Or the game I'd rather have Charisma. It does help if I don't have like a hazmat suit or anything for radiation protection later on though, because it does give rad protection. That intelligence buff is kind of neat though. I think I'm I think I'm gonna prefer the uh Hmm. Put that on. <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna look like such a tool. I'm not putting that on. Sunglasses. Of course, you know we gotta go with the chef's hat, obviously. I'll just deposit the rest for now. Well, actually, not the rest. I'm going to take some of that back. Um, I'll take these back. And now we can go back to the, uh, the place with the locked door that we found. Yeah. Which is in this direction. I would punch you, but I'd love you. He's my only friend in this world. That is not a security baton. That's a security baton. There is also a place by one of these towers that I want to stop by tonight. Um, before we hit up Congard. Just because it'll help us with our encounter there. I cannot finesse this today. There. Yeah, so this, this area is off limits. I think it's, I don't even think it's a mountains, I think it's just an invisible wall. There are some off-limits areas that we should be able to get to later on. But those are DLC. You know what I mean? It's
we literally just... No, we're not all the way. Okay. That's it. Get sauced. Dope. I'm gonna fast travel here. Just because it's close and there's no danger. What's going on in the YouTube scape? I cook up some of this meat I'm gonna store most of my junk if it weren't for the gear in the springs I might sell that but I honestly think in terms of worth I'd rather just have the gold bars for now and I'll sell some like guns and stuff that I pick up that's kind of my overall strategy just find weapons lying on people and sell those. We cooking boys. Do I not have mole rat? I guess I don't have mole rat. Or enough mole rat, I mean. Dude, I am the best looking person on planet Earth. I'm gonna sauce them up, bro. They won't even see it coming. Okay. There's gonna be a blowfly, I believe, in this building. That or a roach. I think a roach might come from somewhere. Yeah, here. Spadoink. I think all is good now. Okay, cool. So first off, I think it's on this side. If not, no, wait. No, it's here. It's across the thing. B -b -b bridge. So we gotta go across the bridge and then literally just head in this direction. There are gonna be an enemy or two that we'll have to be aware of. But essentially... We get some free stuff, which is nice. If you see me crouching, it's because that uh, that hidden thing shows up and it shrinks when we're near some baddies. Oh, the okay. Rad stags are good for food. There they are. I shoshed him. Got shoshed. Make sure the rod stag. Okay, well if that comes back and tries to kill me later, then it comes back and tries to kill me later. I'm not gonna fuss about it. Sometimes they just do that. I don't know how they're coded to deal with violence. I know they can attack you, I just don't know what prompts it. flip lighter so there's stuff in here neat with this and underneath if you can see it there there's some uh first aid kit you will take a bit of rad damage um so that's just one part of what we need to do here next up we gotta go here open this thing follow it up here. There are going to be enemies nearby. First off, caps. Second off, 
gun. 44 is nice. More bobby pins. I think we got a pretty bad, uh, I don't know if the yellow fedora is even good. Let me check. Might be better than my chef's hat, although I doubt it. <sighs> I want the chef's hat, though. Yeah, there are baddies over this way. That's conquered, by the way. Yeah. That you can hide. Rip dog. if it's just my aim is trash or if I'm I don't know I cannot make shots today I might literally just run up I'm on like a medium difficulty so I won't immediately die but there we go headshot and then I'm just gonna bonk this guy I think It's mildly frustrating, but I'll deal with it. We're good. Hopefully I won't have to go all the way back and... No. No. Thank God. Okay. Yeah, okay. So I just got to fast travel back to uh, Sanctuary here. I don't have to do the whole Codsworth section again, thank God. Gotta grab the gold bar. Zuh. And then... I'm literally just gonna skip the roaches, I don't care. I think I still have to cook though. Yeah, okay. And I'll save here. That's weird. It turns the uh, the visual parts of the stream off when I go into the save menu. I'll just beat up the roach. It's only one. Be moving now. I'm not. I don't care about being careful. 
Might just vats the dog to be honest. I'm trying to I've, I've been trying to use vats more. It is a gameplay element. I don't want to be stingy with my video game tastes. And honestly it helps a lot when you can't find people. Which happens way more than it should be in this game. Cool thing about vats though is that if you uh do that you can completely miss every shot. Hello, oh sorry, wrong dude. Bushes are insurpassable. I'm not gonna mess with the red stack, I don't feel like it. We looked at each other, we had a bonding moment. If it attacks me from behind, I'm gonna cry. Danger, mole rat. Bing bong. What you be do? I gotta heal, man. I can't go walking into a gunfight with like no health. I do that way too often. Blah blah blah, flip the thing. Do the shit. Shoot the skeleton. Save the game. Snipe the dog. Where our far be? Where he be? I'd be stuck on a tree. close I can get to them before they notice I exist. About that close. I was all like pew pew and shit. I'll have you know I'm a grown ass man. Damn, another show. Damn, bro, if you was if I knew you was packing that. Ah. 
I don't know where the other guys went. The loot might just be gone. Everything blends in because everything's brown. This game. That shotgun is nice. Very cool. Save the game as always. question is where do I go from here because I want to go I got to go to the uh, the towers I know that the, uh, the cell towers they're not cell towers y'all know what I mean hopefully I'm just gonna fast travel back to sanctuary again I I have no shame in abusing fast travel for the sake of convenience coming in tonight. Not in real life, I don't think anyone's coming in tonight, but in game tonight. I might actually have some junk too that I should get rid of. Yeah. See if I can cook anything up too. Right, then we gotta level up. And then I'll see if I can upgrade some of the weapons I have. I'm not a fan of automatic weapons in this game. I think I just want the hardened receiver. Yeah. Comfort grip is nice. Don't have what I need for the big mag. Don't care about glow sights. I usually use the other circle reflex, but I don't have enough nuclear material for that. Okay, cool. Let's see if I can mess with this too. Hard receiver. Sawed off. I need science for that one, I know that. Um, the bowl barrel is where we want to be at at the end, but I'm not going to bother doing that for reasons. Comfort grip is fine. Ooh. Um. I will never be using pipe pistols. I don't care. Let me equip some of these. Shotgun, and then pistol. Let's get her level up. I don't know if I want to upgrade stats or abilities yet. Black Widow, I think, is one of the main reason reasons 
why choosing the woman is better than choosing the man. Because you can actually just persuade men better, and there are way more men in this game than there are women. Or at least, assumably, there are. From what I've heard. I don't even think assumably is a fucking word. I'm half asleep, brain wise. Um. This might be cool. Scrapper might be cool for uh, raider armor early on. I think lock picking is where I want to be at though, because then I can just go and do the safe that we found earlier and not have to worry about coming back to it later. Which I'm just gonna do right now. I don't know if we'll get to conquer tonight. I think I'm just gonna go do the uh the towers. And the quest line that comes with that. I think the only thing that pre-war money is good for is selling, to be honest. Because if you can if you can scrap armor for cloth, I'm like what's even the point, you know? You get so much clothes and armor throughout the course of the game. You have access to so much clothes and armor. Medex, I think, is a... No, it's not a drug. Blood packs are for crafting. I don't need that. I wonder if I have any more pre-war money in here. Because if I do, I'm just going to take it. Yeah. Oh my god, dude. Okay, cool. These are the towers that I'm talking about with the cables on. There's one tower here that has good stuff for us. I thought you could hide from me. You thought. Ah. Thought that I wouldn't spadoy some when I had the chance. He was just hanging on that wall unsuspectingly. Every now and then, I just completely forget where the hell I'm going and what the fuck I'm doing. I gotta cross the bridge first. I think I remember something being up here too. <gasps> A blue fly. Sauced him. Absolutely sauced him.
that's where we're going next, by the way. That was going to be next session, though. Yeah, there's nothing here. You see the lights coming. This is where we're going next. Not canonically where we have to go next, but there is a cool quest line here. Also, I don't remember that place. Cool. That might be a complex that I'm thinking of. Excuse me, guys. I'm just going to go sit until the morning. Just wait a casual t uh, 12 hours, you know? Like any normal human being would. I don't know if I'm going to steal anything from these guys. You can pretty easily, New to be here? honest. Well, if you've got anything worth trading, God, I gotta turn off that, uh, don't talk to me mod. They will become hostile if you steal something. Hey. I take it you want to trade? What have you got? It ain't a lot, but I've got a few basic supplies. Ammo, meds, that sort of thing. You'd think on a farm you'd have produce, not ammo and meds. The potatoes and melons are for the Laja trade up in Diamond City, not to mention our own table. So, still interested? What's a tato? Short for potato? Let's just say it's the mighty, rad-resistant cousin of the tomato and potato. Potatoes, mute fruit, taberries. Things change to survive nuclear fallout. Get used to it. How is the trade with Diamond City? Good, when my husband actually gets around to doing it. That is, if no one raids the farm first. Why do you think I'm selling ammo and meds? You can't protect yourself? The Commonwealth will swallow you right up. Can't say I've been to Diamond City yet. Biggest city in the Commonwealth. Anything you need, anything you want to know, that's the place to start. All right. All right, dope. So, sell my wedding rings. L husband. I don't even know if I can sell the gold bar. Even if I buy all the ammo off of her and stuff. Corn might be nice actually, and the right away too. I don't need shipments yet, that's that's for way later on. I do want to try and snag as much money off of her as I can though. So 265, we're gonna need 240. That should be everything. That's all our caps. Cool. Broke. I'm also stealing your food. Because that doesn't count as stealing because it's an interactable. This is a guy that we have to talk to last, so I'm going to go talk to, uh... Where the hell is she? The daughter that we got to talk to. Is she inside or something? Here for work? We could use some help picking melons if you've got some spare time. Why are you just I'll standing you here staring at the wall? Did you say caps? Why would I want those? Yeah, like bottle caps? 
And because it's money? Uh, at least it is here in the Commonwealth. You guys pay for things with bottle caps? What happened to dollars and cents? That old stuff? Not too useful these days. Unless you're looking to stock up your outhouse. What are you paying? Three caps per melon. Not a bad deal, if you ask me. And now we can sauce them. Aw, oh, yeah. Make it five. Deal? Deal. But let's keep it between the two of us. The last thing I want is another lecture from my mom. There are just so many events like this. In the early game especially, where you can just sauce people out of money. That's why I dump a lot of my points into Charisma. I'm not gonna like min max like if I mess up a charisma thing I'm not gonna auto I'm not gonna like save before an event and go back to it if I fail I fail but I'm gonna try and be as successful as I can to give you guys the dialogue trees Bobby pins nice we got. Dude, we are getting all the adhesive in the world now. I don't know if that's normal or the game, and I've just had a really shitty luck. What is that? Oh, that's them. <laughs> okay. Well, the question is, can I talk to her through the wall? She's gone. She's gone. So yeah, the way stealing works in this game, everybody shut up. Dude. Dude. Best part of the game, period. Yeah, I mean, I'd be chilling. What you saying, dog? Speak your truth. If I can feed the cat, I will feed the cat. I if 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 somebody sees this video and says that I can feed the cat, I will go and figure out figure out if I can feed the cat or not. Miss Abernathy, here to collect the caps for the melons you gathered. What's the pay? It's five caps per melon, just as we agreed. You ready to collect? Now the funny thing is you can just say, haha, I'm stealing your melons. Uh, but I want the money, unfortunately. Yeah. Here you go. Great. Thanks for your help. I think that is the best price that you can get for melons. Like selling them, I mean. If I go and I try to sell a melon and it sells for like ten caps, I'm gonna go and murder this entire family. Not actually. Yo, hang on, we chillin'. Yo. What's up, bro? Yo. Alright. I have stuff to do, cat. I will see you later. Excuse me. This is a guy that we gotta talk to. Give him a second, like 40 minutes to finish his animation. That's close enough, stranger. We're a peaceful farm. We don't want any trouble. It's okay. I'm friendly. Not looking to cause any trouble. If you say so, but be warned. We're armed here. So don't try anything. Look, we're simple farmers. I we see the red stags. We just want to be left alone. <laughs> I see them. The temptation is there. I'm not going to lie. The temptation to stop talking and just go nuke them. Farming's hard work. Won't argue with that. Blake Abernathy, you new to the Commonwealth? Yes. And no. It's a long story. Either way, good to see a new face. How about you? Ever think about work in the land? <laughs> I 
fucking, I can't get over the fact that fucking, like, the stupid ass I'll chef's probably give it a try someday. Well, good luck to you then. Maybe I'll see you at the Diamond City Market someday and we'll do a swap. Word of advice, though. If you do start up a farm, be ready to deal with the Raiders. Why do all the hard work when you can just take what you want at gunpoint? Sounds like bad news to me. You really are new to these parts. Best armed bastards in the Commonwealth. You have something they want, they won't hesitate to take it. Last time those raiders hit us, my daughter Mary tried to stand up to them. Now she's buried out back of the house. Only 21 years old, and they shot her down without a thought. That's why we need the Minutemen back. And the sooner, the better. What happened to the Minutemen? Don't rightly know. I suppose they just went on to other things. The Raiders are certainly making the most of the opportunity. I don't have much to offer, but those Raiders that killed Mary, they took her locket too. It's been in Connie's family for generations. If you could get it back, it'd mean a lot to us. Do you know where they're coming from? Yeah, pretty sure I do. One of them mentioned Olivia while they were here. My guess is they're holed up in that old USAF station. <clears throat> All right, boys. This is going to be the last mission for the night, I believe. Completing this one and bringing the uh, locket back. It is a bit of a walk. But on the way there, if I remember correctly, I think there's going to be some great loot. So, we will see. So yeah, next time, I'm probably just going to stick to strict story missions. Like, there, there might be a place or two that I might pop into and just get some stuff from, but... You know what? Might as well go and do the Red Rocket now. That one's pretty short. I'll go and do that in the, uh, the, uh, the little dungeon that's hidden here. Just so I have some homies to go with, too. We're him. They're him. Arf. Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? <laughs> you seem like an okay guy. Okay, then. Let's stick together. <sighs> yeah. I think, like, I think, um... God, I think the, uh... The male voice actor is better at, uh... Goofy shit like that. Because every time I try to do one of the goofy voice options with with the, with this female character, it's always just, like, normal as hell or like super serious which is i mean she's way better at like serious situations like i said so it's going to be nice when we actually have to get into parts and then it's like oh, i'm gonna murder you and all that shit i'm closing the door see ya um but like when it comes to like the goofy voice options i don't know how to feel about it the Giddy Up Buttercup stuff is interesting. Oh! 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 Controller died! Uh oh! You know what? That might actually be an uh oh. Because I don't know if I have somewhere I can plug it in. I'm plugging my microphone into the, uh, the PlayStation right now. And I have a, uh, Huh. There's an interesting predicament. Well, okay. I do have... Oh. My controller is at two. Oh, wait, no. Never mind. Alright. My microphone is going to disconnect for a second here. I will have to switch to the... uh. The 
earbud mic. But I will be back momentarily. Now the question is The question is Can you guys hear me? Yeah, okay It says you can hear me so I'm going to trust that you can hear me Let me actually check this room though Because last time I trusted that you guys could hear me You could not hear me Dude, why is that better? Why does that sound better? I... Dude. I spent all this money on a decent microphone. Like, not... To be fair, I didn't spend like a hundred bucks, but I think it was like forty bucks a few years ago that I bought it for recording. And then I literally just hook up my Sony mic. My Sony earbuds my controller and it's a million times better whatever not gonna get salty about it oh we got visitors dude I cannot make shots today gonna go with the baton for now man that was so much better hello yo dog meat victory dance We dancing. Oh, there is stuff that I have to do with dog meat once I'm done collecting all the stuff here. Yo! I didn't realize somebody was here. Hello. He was not lacking. He was not at all lacking. He was chilling. I think he killed a couple of them. Oh, oh, he said a bad word. I'm banned. Demonetized. Yep. It goes my entire career. So, Caleb, just an update. Uh, I went to the Abernathy farm. I, uh, I grabbed, I talked to them, I'm going to do the, uh, oh, okay, good night then. <laughs> I was going to explain the situation, but, you know. <laughs> Alright, sleep tight, good night smooches. Mwah. Oh, there is a place here that I got to get to. We get up at 8 tomorrow. I don't know, man. Colon 3. Fungus of the brain.
Wait, what time is it now if you have to be up at 8? Dude, go to bed. Get your rest, man. Yeah, this is up. Winnie says hi. He just came out of the room. So this is where all the mole rats came from, by the way. He's got fucking smack. Cool, we got stuff in here. Um... Yeah, there's gonna be some great loot here. I think that might be all the enemies in here. Keep peeking. Sweet. Got that too. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna get rads here, so we gotta be quick about this. But there is a fusion core. Fusion cores are probably one of the they're one of the rarest and best resources in the game. For reasons that I will get into in a bit. I know a lot of people watching this have probably seen the game or at least know what's going on vaguely, but if somebody comes on and they haven't seen it, then you know. We're spoiler free. Okay, so again, this is conquered. This is where the story goes down. Not going there yet. Going to a different place. Going here. No, unselect the main quest too. Okay. So it is just in this direction then. Oh, I gotta heal. I'm not paying attention. If there's a cook I think there is a cooking station out back. I mean I wanna cook up some of the meat that I got. Yeah. So we get a consistent stim pack supply of like once once we get to a diamond city. Meat's gonna be our, our main healing thing, I think. And we're just gonna save stim pack for injuries. Plus you get some good buffs from uh eating cooked meat. There are some dudes up here, I'm gonna see if I can get them. They don't have any good loot. Yeah, see. The mosquitoes. Um, I don't think they have any good loot. But it's free XP. So. There's one. The annoying part about those guys is that they like to fly into the woods and then come back like immediately after. Don't know where he went though. Oh, there he is. Bonjour. Ooh. 
gasp. going over here. I don't think the raiders, yeah, the raiders can't respawn in this area. At least not that soon. I didn't see this earlier. It's cool. So that giant satellite dish is where we're going, by the way. There are going to be baddies there. Oh, this is what I was talking about. So this is a crashed vertebrate. Um, I think that's what they're called. Leave the animals alone, Eric. Um, there's stuff in here. Dead soldiers. Uh, cool stuff. What's really interesting is here. This is power armor. It's basically just a complete set of power armor. In the middle of nowhere. So now we will be at an advantage when dealing with the, uh, the raiders. I'm not gonna mess with the, uh, the red sags. I don't think that we would have been able to get this had we not found the, uh, the fusion core at the, um, at the mole rat cave. What the hell? That mole rat just had a bomb strapped to it. Oh, okay. Oh, we leveled up. Um... I don't care about commando. I don't care about rifles. Go gunslinger for now. Increase our damage output. So there are some scary people in here. If you're not confident in your abilities in this game, you might get frustrated here.
deceased. I don't know if we'll get the prompt in here, but there's just so much like attention to detail in this game. Like sometimes if you're fighting raiders in power armor, they'll be like, oh my god, he has power armor, blah blah blah, all this shit. Like they'll warn people about it, which is awesome. Or they'll like make fun of you for it. So I'm going to be stealthy in here for as long as I can. To begin with, there's this. There's stuff in here that you're going to want to grab. You're basically just going to want to loot as much as you can. They have a ton of good stuff in here. Mainly junk. Um, but you will get some great stuff for this point in the game. Need the terminal for that. Can't break the code. Which I don't have yet. I think we can get a key for that what? later on though. Okay, well. Didn't want to do that, but it happened. So. How were we not found? No complaints. Rip doggo. anything in the dookie machine. There's a plunger in the dookie machine. The hell was that? Here you go. How was nobody hearing this? Don't know if there's anyone in this room, but I know that there are people in the next room over. There's a toolbox there that I want to nab. Yeah. There's a pipe revolver. I don't care. I just want the ammo. Um, and the tools. Okay. So in terms of this playthrough, pretty useless, but, you know. Hey. Oh, speaking of which, there's another fusion core here. Hot plates are dope. If you see a hot plate, I always grab it. Got a lot of good stuff in it. Military circuit boards, I think, are the best. Probably one of the best junks in the game. Alright, we gotta be careful here. Yeah. So, you probably saw there's a guy with a minigun back there. Oh. Dog meets down. Oh. 
We good. We cool. Playing games with me, huh? Yes, I am playing games. I'm playing video games. Okay. Yoink. Top 10 video game jump scares. Yo, wait a second, I forgot something. Yo, hey. you. First off. This. Second off. This. And now we spiffy. It's all spiffy. So we didn't get the key yet. We will in just a second here. There's still one place that we have to explore. Did I grab the minigun? Oh wait, I, I, you can actually still grab the launch box, I forgot. Yeah, there's a minigun. I think I'm over encumbered now though, you yeah. know. Okay, hang on. See if I got any junk I can toss. Is there something here that weighs six? It's kind of trash. Get it. Uh, I might drop some of the weapons if they're heavy. Pool cue. That's gonna be worth something. The shotguns. Probably worth something. Pipe pistols are... I honestly don't know if I want to sell any of these, or drop any of these. I just have armor that I can drop, yeah. Long johns are trash, if I remember. I'll just get some of the Raider armor too. Bro, I would be the worst hoarder. I'm holding on to every single thing that I have here. Turpentine. There's that. I may literally immediately be over encumbered again. Oh, okay. So there's stuff back here. You may notice that the floors look a bit more oily than usual. That's because there's That's oil it. on them. Pew pew. Just wait for the fire to go down. I don't think we can be damaged by fire and the red, yeah, in the uh, power suit. I think we're just good. I think we're also pretty much immune to. <laughs> Sorry.
Sorry, I think we're also pretty much immune to radiation damage. I wish we were also immune to, uh, giant cockroaches. Giant roaches? Hello? You, okay, you know I'm a fucking sweat at this game? When I remember every single spot the goddamn cockroaches are gonna pop out at? Slowly moving. Okay, so we do take some rad damage. But it's reduced, so I don't really care. I believe that we got a key somewhere along the way there. Get spadoinked. Just taking our time. Let's see if I can drop. Don't care. Don't care. Don't care. Do not care. Zero fox. Trash. Pass. Don't care. Don't care. Do not care. Don't care. Don't care. I have six coffee cups. Why? To be honest with you, I might literally just have to walk encumbered back to the farm. Because I know there's going to be more stuff here. moving. So yeah, there should be a key to that door that we had to uh, access the terminal to unlock. And that's going to have some dope stuff in it. Terminal. Yeah, there we go. So that's just a mini nuke. Just a nuke flying out, you know. There's a safe here. This is gonna have weapons in it, I believe. Got it. Pretty warm money, still cool. Yeah, so there's some good junk in there at least. Um there's that. Antique globe, surprisingly good. Cigarettes sell for a lot. Cool stuff in there. Microscopes are great. Lockets are great. Or not lockets, actually, watches, so I might just trash that. Okay. And now, time for housekeeping. Most interesting part of the game right here, boys.
So there's certain stuff that you learn to look for after playing this game. Cigarettes sell pretty good for how common they are. Pre-war money is great for how common it is. Fiberglass is rare. I don't know about, I don't remember silver that much. Springs are great. Basically less like, you care a lot less about like steel and stuff like that. And a lot more about like circuitry, fiberglass, springs. Stuff that you can use to make weapons upgrades. And that's also going to sell for a lot more. So if you're looking for money, those are usually the best too. Like the Wonder Glue here, it just gives you adhesive, but it's 20. Because adhesive is used for so much stuff. And it's harder to come by. Um, mini nukes are ammo for Fat Man weapons. Which are literally just nuke launchers. I have a lot of potatoes that I don't need. I might just get rid of some of the uh, the trash, like wild stuff. I don't know if it's going to make that much of a difference. I don't care about drugs regardless. Let's see if I can get if I can't get rid of some armor here. Why is a drifter outfit? Oh well, it's because it's good. Got to be fashionable. I can't not be fashionable. That's not an option. Red or leathers aren't worth anything. Okay, so this will at least give us enough stuff to get back to uh, the Abernathy farm to fast travel there. Not to worry about walking back. Fast travel. So I was stuck between this and Skyrim, and I asked, I don't know if it was on stream, we played for a little bit after I ended the stream, um, but on the Skyrim and Minecraft stream, stream that we did last night, I asked him if he wanted me to do Skyrim or Fallout. And he said Fallout. So we'll be doing Fallout. Hey there. I take it you want to trade? That'd be great. Yeah, she doesn't have any money back in. She must be laying down, so I'll just wait until morning. I can't sit in power armor, I see. Wonder if I can literally just go to his room and wake him up. It'd be funny. What are you doing in the rain? Oi. I will shelter you. Dog made help me shelter. The cat does not want shelter. We must go inside. We have failed. I've got that locket back for you. You serious? That's great news. Connie's gonna be speechless. I'm sure she'll go lean on her prices after what you've done. And feel free to use our workshop. 
least we can do. So, uh, feel free to use our workshop in this game means that we unlock a new settlement. As you can see here, we can now build stuff, we can, uh, put stuff in. We don't need to defend this place. But the issue is that if we don't at least set up defenses, then they're gonna get anxious and start leaving. They probably should. At least, at least just like a turret, you know. Yeah. And we're literally fine with just that. I don't really plan on, you know, having too many people in here. Gas canisters are nice. I'm gonna basically take all these guys young to grab line them down. Cells in the shotgun shells in here. <sighs> I'll just drop what I can. There's a stim back here that I kind of like though. Some water. And taters. So I'm not going to set up any like settlement attraction things basically on any of my stuff. Just because I'm not looking for people. I'm not looking for that aspect of this game in this run. Knuckles I don't care about. Wow, man, I'm, I'm I'm really being a hoarder right now, huh? You kind of have to in this game, though, you know? Because every little piece of... Every little piece of, um... Junk can be worth a lot more than you think it is. God, man, I saw all this stuff to get rid of. Um, I'm putting the minigun in here. I don't care about the minigun. I really don't. I've never had a time where a minigun's been useful. Except in, you know, in a spot that's coming up. But even then, I won't need it for reasons. Alright, we're gonna go drop our stuff off, see if we can't get some quick weapon upgrades. See if there's not a trader that comes by. And then that's gonna be it for the night. I might literally just, um, just so I don't have to carry it all, I might make, I might make just a, uh, god damn it, what am I trying to say here? I'm going to make like a box for stuff that I want to sell.
I'll just put that in like... Okay, I'm gonna gotta leave this power armor. It's being annoying. I'll fucking leave the power armor. X. If you ever feel like clipping it back in, by the way, all you have to do is craft using it. And then it'll automatically clip into position. Let's build some, uh, I think it's under furniture. Yeah, just a quick container here. Oh, wait, no, I have one already. Doi. Okay, cool. So this is where I'm going to put all my junk weapons and stuff. Um, things I'm never going to use. Molotovs might be the only throwables that I'm going to use. Like, just trash weapons, basically. Um, stuff like this. Stuff that basically sells for a lot. But I'm not going to use it. Fantastic or drugs, I don't care about that. And these are sellables. I might just keep the other pretty warm money on me. Since it's pretty light, I think. Yeah, it's weightless. I think everything else we can afford to just keep in there for now. We'll see about weapons upgrades real quick. I don't think I have any better receivers that I can get for this. The long barrel. No, I like the hip fire accuracy. I don't want to sacrifice that. No better receiver. No better stock. Can't upgrade that. Prefer head fire. Yeah, okay. I think we're pretty much set. I might have armor upgrades, but... Yeah. Okay, cool. Well... For whoever is watching in the future, or whoever joined for the stream, thanks for watching. Um, hopefully you guys are cool with the series. I look on, I look forward to a play in this in the future. I don't know how consistently I'm going to be doing this series in particular, but... Um, you know, still be streaming when I can, all that stuff. And uh, the rest of you guys, have a good night, day, whatever it is. Yep.